10 Guidelines from God Number 1. Quit Worrying Life has dealt you a blow and all you do is sit and worry. Have you forgotten that I am here to take all your burdens and carry them for you? Number 2. Put it on the list. Something needs to be done or taken care of. Put it on the list. No, not your list. Put it on my to-do list. Let me be the one to take care of the problem. I can't help you until you turn it over to me. And although my to-do list is long, I can take care of anything you put into my hands. Number 3. Trust me. Once you've given your burdens to me, quit trying to take them back. Trust in me. Have the faith that I will take care of all your needs, your problems, and your trials. Problems with the kids? Put them on my list. Problem with finances? Put it on my list. Problems with your emotional roller coaster? Put it on my list. I want to help you. All you have to do is ask. Number 4. Leave it alone. Don't wake up one morning and say, well, I'm feeling much stronger now, I think I can handle it from here. Why do you think you are feeling stronger now? It's simple. You gave me your burdens and I'm taking care of them. I also renew your strength and cover you in my peace. Don't you know that if I give you these problems back, you will be right back where you started? Leave them with me and forget about them. Just let me do my job. Number 5. Talk to me. I want you to forget a lot of things. Forget what was making you crazy. Forget the worry and the fretting because you know I'm in control. But there's one thing I pray you never forget. Please, don't forget to talk to me, often. I love you. I want to hear your voice. I want you to include me in on the things going on in your life. I want to hear you talk about your friends and family. Prayer is simply you having a conversation with me. I want to be your dearest friend. Number 6. Have faith. I see a lot of things from up here that you can't see from where you are. Have faith in me that I know what I'm doing. Trust me, you wouldn't want the view from my eyes. I will continue to care for you, watch over you, and meet your needs. You only have to trust me. How hard can trust be? Number 7 share. You were taught to share. When did you forget? Share with those who are less fortunate than you. Share your joy with those who need encouragement. Share your laughter with those who haven't heard any in such a long time. Share your tears with those who have forgotten how to cry. Share your faith with those who have none. Number 8. Be patient. I managed to fix it so in just one lifetime you could have so many diverse experiences. You grow from a child to an adult, have children, change jobs many times, learn many trades, travel to so many places, meet thousands of people, and experience so much. 
How can you be so impatient then when it takes me a little longer than you expect to handle something on my to-do list? Trust in my timing, for my timing is perfect. Number 9. Be kind. Be kind to others, for I love them just as much as I love you. They may not dress like you, or talk like you, or live the same way you do, but I still love you all. Please try to get along, for my sake. I created each of you different in some way. Please, know I love each of your differences. Number 10. Love yourself. As much as I love you, how can you not love yourself? You were created by me for one reason only, to be loved, and to love in return. I am a god of love. Love me. Love your neighbors. But also love yourself. It makes my heart ache when I see you so angry with yourself when things go wrong. You are very precious to me. Don't ever forget. God bless you always. Together, let us spread the good news. If you like our content, support us by clicking the subscribe button and notification bell to get updates on our channel. You can also like, share, and comment below. Together, let us spread the good news. Upliftments 101